Oh, hi there. What follows is a review for the Lincoln LE31MP MIG, TIG, and Stick Welder, available at your local Home Depot for $7.99. Now, the uh, Lincoln LE31MP can run both gas and electric, and it comes in at about 55 pounds, making it a pretty flexible and capable portable unit. It also draws 130 amps of current, and uh, it requires 110 volts, meaning that you can plug it into your household power supply. So, to review this thing properly, oh, <sighs> that's better. I knew I was forgetting something. To review the Lincoln LE31 MP properly, I not only tested it out myself, but I also had uh, my buddy test it, who's a far more experienced welder than I am. And here are our opinions of the Lincoln LE31 MP multi-purpose welder. It was far easier to set up than other welders I've experienced, and it also seemed to be a lot more consistent in terms of the weld. I mean, I felt like I, I had plenty of juice, and I was able to keep the welds going, both stick and MIG, and it was just easy to use. Uh, the way it felt in my hand was, uh, it, it just felt right. I guess that's the best way to put it. I mean, using it, I actually enjoyed welding, and that is not always the case with the budget or, you know, used welders that I've been utilizing in the past. Now, my buddy, uh, opinions of it were a little more reserved. You know, he said, it, you know, it's a good welder. Um, it's nothing special, but, you know, it gets the job done, and there's nothing negative, no complaints. Now, um, you know, in terms of overall negatives, we only really had three. Um, the first negative being uh, when we opened up when we opened up the side you know cabinet to uh, to change the uh, uh, to basically put the spool on to do some MIG welding um, and by the way it does come with two spools both flux and non flux core uh, so you're ready to go there and uh, and the spindle is actually adjustable so it can hold it can hold I think four and eight inch um, diameter spools I believe that's correct anyway um, the two most common spool sizes. And so we put our spool, when putting our spool on there, uh, we had trouble getting the wing nut off because there was some material from the, uh, the spindle uh, when it was tapped that was left there when they stuck the wing nut on, you know, in the factory. And so we actually had to use a wrench to get off, and that was a minor annoyance. So the second thing was, um, and this is a comment from my, my buddy, when he was using it, he felt a vibration in the gun, he said, that made him think that the, the, uh, the MIG... Um, you know, the filler material was actually coming faster than it was, and it kind of like screwed up with his, his mojo a little bit when he was welding. Um, he said it's probably just, you know, uh, something unique to the gun and it's something he'll get used to. And the third thing was the kit came with the, the MIG attachments. Basically, you know, I guess you could say the MIG kit. Um, it came with the, uh, the stick kit. Uh, it didn't come with sticks, but, you know, that's no big deal. Um, but it didn't come with the TIG kit. The TIG kit sold separately. And on the packaging, it says, you know, uh, three in one, you know, three welders for, for the price of one, um, includes all the attachments so that you're ready to, ready to go. Um, yeah. And so outside of that, you know, it really was plug and play. It had everything we needed to get going. And so that's our impressions of the LE31 MP, uh, you know, MIG, TIG and stick welder, again, available at your local Home Depot for the price of $7.99. Uh, so what follows now is some footage of us using the welder and, uh, you know, also opening it up and you'll see everything that it comes with as we see it. So I hope you enjoy and thanks again. Thanks for watching and uh, talk to you soon. That's my welding helmet instructions. <laughs> Nicely packed. regulator Now, welding kits usually come with all this stuff, or not unless they're an MPI, then they come with the extra stick attachment.
we go. Woohoo! Anybody that loves reds gotta love the look at that thing. Yeah. 